Hello, students. So here we are having a question right now. Uh, let's uh, read it out first of all, and then we will discuss how to solve this. In an experiment, three microscopic latex spheres are spread into a chamber and become charged with charges plus 3E, plus 5E, and minus 3E. Remember, the, this E is actually the elementary charge we all aware of, right? So you need to understand what is E. Respectively, all the three spheres came in contact simultaneously for a moment and got separated. Which one of the following are possible values for the final charges on the spheres? See, what will happen, these three spheres are already having some charges, as you can see, and when they got touched, the charges will no longer remain the same, right? So the Q1, Q2, and Q3 charges on the three spheres will become different. But you need to understand there is a law that we have gone through in the when we were doing first chapter, the law was law of conservation of charge. It simply states neither charge can neither be created nor be destroyed. The sum total of the charge will always remain constant. So right now in the beginning, these three spheres are having the charges plus 3E, plus 5E and minus 3E as you can see. The sum of all the charges is coming out to be uh, minus 3E plus 3E will cancel out each other and 5E plus 5E will be the charges. So it simply means later on, when they are separated after being interacted with each other, the charges on all the three spheres must be equal to 5V, right? So let's do it first of all. Uh, let's take the first option. First of all, plus 5V e minus 4E e plus 5E. E. So let's add plus 5V e plus 5E e is actually 10E ten uh, 10 e, and 10E e minus 4 is coming out to be Yes, everyone knows plus 6C. E. So this is coming out to be plus 6C. E. But we know that Q1 plus Q2 plus Q3 in the beginning was 5E. E. Let me write it here. Q1 plus Q2 plus Q3. What was that? These are the charges on the three spheres before they are being interacted together or touched together, right? So 3E plus 5E e minus uh, 3E. E. So minus 3 will cancel out with 3 and the final answer is coming out to be 5e. As per the law of conservation of charges, the sum of all these charges given in the option must comes out to be plus 5e. If it is not coming out to be plus 5e, it simply means the option is not correct, right? So let's go again. Uh, first option is giving us plus 6e, which is not the correct option. So we can say this is not correct. Now the second option, 6 plus 6 is 12. 12 minus 7 is coming out to be yes. This is 5e. So this could be the uh, correct option. But don't finally come to a conclusion. We all we also have to see C and D options, right? So let's add them. 3.5 and 5.5. 5, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 minus 4 is coming out to be plus 5e. So this could also be the correct option. We will discuss it. But first of all, let's talk about the last option. 7 plus 5 is coming out to be 12. 12 minus 8 is coming out to be plus 4e. So definitely we are sure this should not be the option. Now there are two options, B and C. The correct answer will definitely one of them. But you need to understand there is something, uh, yes, we have discussed, that is called the law of quantization, the quantization of charge, right? Q is equals to any. I hope all of you have gone through it. Q is equals to any. What is N, by the way? n is actually the integral value it could be positive or negative but it should not be in fraction because fractional numbers are called rational numbers but right now the value of n must be an integral value and you can see this is 3.5 5.5 so 3.5 is not a integer we can remove the point write down the 10 simplify it and this comes out to be a rational number so we have to think that 3.5 e is not possible because at electron is not divisible the charge on the electron can't be divided. Either one electron will be transferred, two electron will be transferred, three electrons will be transferred, but the 3.5 electron can't be transferred. So we can say that 3.5e and minus uh, plus 5.5e charge are not possible. So the C option is not correct. And hence the correct option will be the B option. I hope all of you got it. Thank you very much.